Hello everyone and welcome to my first hardware unboxing video. Today we have GeForce GDX 970 G1 Gaming Windforce Edition by Gigabyte. Okay, let's unbox this um, this video card and then we move to the benchmarks. Here we have the Windforce cooling system, flex display. It supports up to four display uh, monitors, four display monitors. Super overclock, you can overclock this to, I hear that you can overclock this to 1524. And we also have GameStream, GameWorks, G-Sync, and DirectX 12. Moving on to the side over here, we have the um, main features I hope you can see oh, just a second here we have the main features in different languages and over this side we have the 4 gigabyte uh, GDDRAM5 or GDDR5 and that's it over here. Here, this it um, explains the cooling system, the wind force cooling system. It supports. Um, it has four heat pipes and a stylish, a stylish metal black uh, backplate. And as I told you before, flex display. It supports for up to four monitors, and we have DVI-D, DVI-I, and three uh, display ports, plus one HDMI, and here we have a super overclock. You can overclock this card and not to be worried about anything, even though you you want overclock this card. Um, now because it works just fine and over here we have dual BIOS and you know other stuff from Gigabyte okay here we have uh, NVIDIA shield ready yeah so let's unbox this card I hope you're ready. There we go. That's the box inside. Uh, it says G1 Gaming, if you can see. And here is our. Here is our GDX 970 with the back plate, with the back plate on, and the three, the three fans, the wind force cooling system here. Here's the SLI and wind force LED. Uh, this uh, lights up uh, in blue. It looks amazing, and. Here we have uh, the 6-pin uh, power connector and the 8-pin power connector. And uh, this is where you put your uh, video card into your motherboard. And that's it. That's the card. Let's see what's inside the box. Here we have... Uh, a 6 pin uh, power converter an 8 pin power converter and a quick guide you really need to uh, to read this, it's important 
and here we have um, driver, but uh, you should download another one from the internet. It would be better, and that's it. So that's that's the card. I'm just gonna put it like this. Just a second. Here's our card. Okay, moving on to the specs for this card. Uh, like I told you, it features a uh, dual link, uh, DVI-I, DVI-D, HDMI, and three display ports. It needs about 550 watts uh, from uh, from your power supply, uh, including six pin connectors and 8 pin connectors just moving the camera okay uh, about the core clock uh, it has um, a GPU 2.0 boost uh, 1329 megahertz uh, also it, it supports DirectX 12 and you should uh, make sure that your case uh, would take or you can put your video card in your case it's very long you can see my hand it's just covering one fan like this it's very long uh, its length is uh, 312 millimeters it supports uh, four multi view and that's it that's the specs okay I tested this card and I'm gonna make uh, some benchmarks as well in this video I'm gonna include some benchmarks but I'm gonna make a whole a whole or a full playlist of benchmarks you should uh, check that out. I'm gonna leave an annotation for the playlist link. Uh, if you want a benchmark of a, s a specific game, just leave a comment and tell me you need um, a benchmark of this of this game, and I'm gonna make I'm gonna make a benchmark of it. Um, just leave a comment. And I'm sorry if I talked a lot, it's my first uh, unboxing for a hardware. I hope it's uh, not the last one. And I hope you like it. Please tell me your opinion. And if I have mistakes, just tell me what is it to fix them or try at least to fix them. I'm doing my best here, guys. And I hope it's it's for the best okay um, I'm gonna tell you about the specs I'm gonna leave a full screen of your of this card specs um, just to make sure you all read it or something then we're gonna move to benchmarks okay I only have this card but I might include some other uh, graphics cards I might just, just get the benchmarks from the internet or something like frame rate of any other game on any other video card uh, I might just do that so let's move on to the specs